Hi everyone. Um, there have been a lot of videos lately that I've seen about how to get popular on YouTube or how to get a partnership. Really, um, I guess I'm not really going for that. I don't know why I joined that group even because I'm in the partnership group. I just thought wouldn't it be great if something I didn't cut on because I could use the income, but I don't. I really don't know why I'm in that because I like YouTube a lot, so I think about these things. But uh, not really. I don't know. I'm just trying stuff out at this point. But my advice to people who do want to um, get thousands of subscribers and everything else. Um, probably just be nice and respond and comment back and stuff like that and just acknowledge people I think a lot of the people I know with between 500 and a thousand subscribers on here those are the ones I probably interact with the most um, or otherwise it's people who you know have a lot of friends or a lot of views or a lot of comments or something going on just because they're networking and I think especially if you've got 500 subscribers but you don't have a thousand and you're kind of going for partnerships so obviously those are going to be the people you talk to more because they're really networking but I mean very few people are going to get like their millions of views or whatever overnight so that's kind of the way you have to do it and that's okay because you know you're kind of selling yourself, so you need, you know it's fine to have a good personality. I don't think you need to be aloof on YouTube <laughs> in order to be popular or taken seriously in any manner, whatever that even means. So um, it's good to spread yourself around, and I don't know, like I'm not gonna assume that people are just faking it because they want the subscription and I'm not going to assume I have like a relationship with them either. I think that's just how YouTube is. Um, you know, it's good for everyone to talk to everyone else. Um, I don't think there's anyone who you can assume that their channel is like irrelevant to you and like that you can't help them or they can't help you or you're not going to learn something from them. So and there's another thing, it's just kind of a trait of the internet that there's like no VIP room on the web. I mean, the more you try to rarefy your audience and exclude people, I think the more you end up just like sabotaging yourself. So yeah, and you're, it's kind of like you have to be deeply superficial because that person that you are online, since this is a social network, but it's not just that, like it's you but it's not really you know so there's probably a balance that you have to find there um, I think Warhol would have been pretty awesome on YouTube I think he would have been popular because he just understands that 15 minutes of fame it like heats out of every social interaction practically is part of the economy I think like where he's saying you know in a love affair sh things should be equal like I'll pay you if you pay me. <laughs> I don't know everything he's got to say in from A to B and back again just reminds me so much of YouTube. It, you really do have to be you know this larger than life but you also have to be very real. And I think that is the key that it has to seem at least like you're engaging people and you do have to engage them even if you're not contacting them directly. But, I mean, there's nothing wrong with doing that either. Because you kind of are a brand and people just own a little bit of you and you want them to feel like you're spreading yourself around evenly, actually. Because otherwise you're not that engaging, if that makes sense. And there are all kinds of different ways to do that. You can do it if you have like an amazingly magnetic personality right in the videos, or you can build up something around it on your channel and the way you are on YouTube that makes people want to see your videos and makes them interesting. So that is how I think one would become popular on YouTube. <laughs> like I said, I'm just kind of uh, playing around. This is my sandbox, but that's how I think you would do it. <laughs>